My name is Eric Phipps, and I'm with the Junction Networks NOC. We've pushed out a change for how Cisco SPA phones handle multiple calls on the same line, and we wanted to make a quick video to demonstrate how that works. I'm going to use a Cisco SPA303 for this, but it should be similar to all other SPA phones. So let's go ahead and give it a call. just take that right off speakerphone so we don't have to worry about that. But this is uh, what it looks like when you have one call on the line. As you can see, this line is lit up, but you can see now that uh, it's blinking to show that there's uh, multiple options there. So let's go ahead and get the second call in. And we'll answer this, and it's going to immediately put that first call on hold. So now what you can do uh, to navigate between these various calls is you can actually just hit this button up here, the blinking one, and you'll see that there's our first call from Junction Test. Here's the second call from my uh, other line. And then uh, it'll show you just the base functionality of what line that you're on, so you can quickly cycle through. So if you had multiple lines and you had multiple calls going, it would be a very easy way to find out uh, which calls you had going with, uh, with which accounts. Um, and you can just sort of get that functionality um, and you can see the soft buttons down here will change showing you what you can do with each individual call and again if you can resume that and it will automatically put the other call on hold or you can just end this call and it's gonna kick this call right back into active status and then you can end this call as well but yeah uh, and then once all the calls are gone you'll see that that is gone back to green but all you need to uh, know is that if this line is blinking, uh, you can actually hit it to get additional information. And that's about all. I hope you found this very informative. Have a good day.